Woman says that she saw Deontay Baber running from the crime scene where Jamie Erton was shot and killed in Walnut Hills two years ago. And prosecutors put her testimony front and center today. Nine on your side, Tamika Artis is here to explain how this testimony fits into the prosecution's case. Tamika. Well, yeah, today that second eyewitness is the second person again to testify uh, that uh, Deontay Baber is the person who she did in fact see running away from the crime scene on that fateful day in March of 2017. Now today, prosecution, uh, prosecutors introduced a video of that woman whose identity we are not allowed to release for our own safety per the judge's orders. At the time, she lived very close to where Jamie Erton was gunned down on Kenton Street in Walnuts Hills. Now in the video, she is seen pointing a Baber out of a photo lineup of six individuals telling an officer that he was the man who she saw running away from the crime scene on the day of the shooting. The man seen in this surveillance video wearing the same orange and blue top that Baber is seen wearing in a Facebook photo. Here was just a little bit of that exchange. Is it creepy? Sure. All right, there you hear her saying, this is him, this is him. The other person who also identified Baber as the shooter is Jamal Killings. He is the father of the four-year-old boy who was hit and is also facing a murder charge in Erton's death. He testified yesterday that he regrets what happened, but says that he did not shoot Erton. In the meantime, prosecutors will be back here tomorrow morning to wrap up their case, and then it is the defense's turn. Reporting live outside of Hamilton County Courthouse, I'm Tamika Artis-Nine on your side.